Hey guys, good morning. It's your inner shoppers. Welcome back to my channel. All right, guys, since we're trying to get answers and stuff, you know, because we're, we're wrapping it up, we're wrapping it up. This is going to be, let's ground first. So guys, this reading here, we're going to speak to the Divine Masculine's uh, sister. It's either going to be his sister, it could be a woman that's his best friend, it could be someone that he works with, it could be a confidant, however, it is a woman. It could be several women, it could be his sisters, his aunts, or whatever, it's not his mother. It's the other woman that he confides in. Not anything sexual. It's who he gets his, his advice from, who he talks to. It's that woman. Okay? So this woman, whoever she is, she knows everything. She knows about the karmic and she knows about the divine masculine. So in this reading here, we're about to find, we're going to ask this woman or these women, what do they think about the karmic with this deck and what do they think about the divine feminine with this deck? All right, guys. Let's get it. All right, best friend, cousin, aunt, confidant, ex. <laughs> what do you think about the situation that's going on with your friend? What do you think about the karmic energy that is in his life at this time? What do you think or know about the karmic energy that's in your friend's life at this time? Who is the holy angels? Okay, let's start here. Three nights. Okay. This best friend is saying that she knows that it was pretty much um she knows she's a she was she's a feisty person, kind of self-assured. She says she's always in her negative energy. Uh, she doesn't see this person as the Empress. Maybe they did have children together, or maybe the girl faked the pregnancy. The karmic, maybe she faked the pregnancy. And then she have Ace of Wands here. She says, um, the karmic didn't inspire this masculine. Like, um, there was no inspiration there. He didn't have the urge to create or build with this karmic here. All right, best friend, cousin, aunt, female energy, knows of the situation. What do you know about this Divine Feminine? What do you think of her? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Best friends, cousin confidant. What do you think about the Divine Feminine? She see that you don't have any regrets regarding this whole situation and that you will walk away from it. You don't have no regrets. You see, she's feeling strong. Mm. Okay, best friend. How do you see this divine feminine? What do you know of her? She can see that this divine feminine pulled her love away from the divine masculine because he's playing too long, playing all wrong. What else? Best friend, female confidant. Mm. Ten of Cups. She does see family contentment, though, and total love and support uh, from this Divine Feminine. She can see that maybe that's what the Divine Feminine offers. Ooh. All right. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Stay with me, best friend, confidant, aunt, female worker. You know, what do you know about the karmic? Mm. Six of Pentacles. That it wasn't an even, it wasn't equal give and take in their situation there. It wasn't fair. Her situation wasn't fair. She says she can see the karmic waking up. She, she was in hangman for a very long time. Maybe she's thinking. Maybe she's starting to process. She's trying to come out of hangman. Maybe she's been thinking about what she's done. All right, best friend. Confidant. Tell us more. 
All right, she's waking up because she wants to offer her cup of love. She wants this new relationship um, with this divine master, and she wants to either stay in a relationship or she wants a new relationship. But she hasn't made any moves. She hasn't moved forward. She hasn't made any moves. And the masculine hasn't made any moves towards her. All right. <laughs> Confidant, best friend. What do you think or know about this divine feminine here in this situation? Five of Swords. Five of Swords in regards. She's walking away. She feels like, um, she said Divine Feminine feels like that this was like in an abusive relationship. Like mentally abusive. With all this back and forth and all this, um, what do you call it? Gaslighting. And the masculine is saying, saying things, saying nothing. Very holy angels. What else do you know, best friend, confidant? The female energy within this masculine's life that he talks to about his situation. She can see that this divine feminine, she's not going to play a part. She, she won't be a part of three. She's not going to be a lover to anything. She says it's either me or nothing. Yeah. She sees this divine feminine as a supportive, a nurturing person. She's a healer. She's very loving. But she pulled her love back from this masculine here. She keeps telling this masculine, you about to lose her. You about to lose this one masculine. Yep. Because this this divine feminine has to will a fortune. Like everything about her is just good, good. She is good, good. Good fortune. Turning points in her life. Luck. She's like the crystal ball. It's like you rub her, you know, and shit just happens. You know, you, you go ahead and you rub that divine feminine if you want to. Mm -hmm. That's what this friend is saying. She said, go ahead and rub that divine feminine if you want to. She said, masculine, that's where your luck is. She said, that's where your luck lies. All right, what else do you know about this karmic best friend? Best friend, aunt, sister. Ten of Pentacles. She know that this masculine is walking away. From this legacy, this retirement, this inheritance here, whatever, what was built up over there. She said he's willing to leave it. He's willing to walk away. Ooh, what else? Yep. She said the masculine is standing in his power when it comes to walking away from this situation. She knows he's walking away from it. She said he's, he took off the blindfolds. He's not scared. He's not in his head anymore. He's not... Um, being inflicted, self-imposed infliction on himself. What else do you know, best friend? What else do you know? She knows the masculine doesn't want to juggle anymore. He doesn't want to be in this situation anymore. He doesn't want to put the divine feminine in this situation anymore. Mm -hmm. Best friend said, I be getting on his ass about it. Yep, she said, I get on his ass about it. Says he's hard headed and stubborn. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What else do you know, best friend, aunt, sister, confidant, about this divine feminine? What else do you know about the situation? She knows this three of cups. She knows this um, divine feminine won't play. She knows she won't be juggled. She won't even entertain it. She won't even entertain the thought. You want to entertain it. You, me, and he. You, me, and she. You, you, and you. You got me screwed. Okay. She said, this divine feminine said, if that's what you want to do, masculine, she said, let the games begin. She said, this tower can fall. She goes, I'll tilt it first. She goes, I'll bump this thing with my hip. Bam. She goes, let's make it fall. She said, we can do this. I will not, she said. She said, that divine feminine, they will not be a part or no three party anything. Anybody signing up for that? You better sneak a third party on somebody. Because ain't nobody doing that. 
Yeah, she said she's not with it. She goes, I'm not working. She said, that's not how I roll. <laughs> that is not how I roll. She goes, I'm not putting in no work for that. She goes, I'm not putting in any work. You put on third party anything. Okay. Thank you, best friend, confidant. What else? Okay. Best friend, confidant. She see this divine feminine. Okay. She says, I'm not going to lose money or sleep over this. She says, I will not lose money nor sleep over this. Okay. Nope. And the friend says she also knows that the masculine knows he needs to work on his money before he comes to you. All right, what else you know, best friends? Okay. Over here, she knows this karmic still wants this union. She wants that family union. She wants that connection over there. She wants to keep it together at all costs. At all costs. Look, yep, at all costs. She's willing to fight this. She is willing to fight this. She says, I will self-protect myself against any competition, anything. Look, even her cat, she pulled her pussy out. She said, she pulled it out. <laughs> it's a black cat, guys. Y'all so nasty. It's a pussy cat. But she pulled the cat out, and the cat is hissing like, like you better get back, get back, get back, get back, get back, okay? She's fighting for that connection there. But... The best friend, cousin, sister, aunt, confidant. They said it's not working. She's still. She's trying to heal her heart, but it's not working. She's trying. It's just not working. It's just not working. Her efforts are failing. Yeah, because look, he's walking away. He's walking away because it was just. The best friend said it was just a lusty time with this karmic here. Like he was just. You know, he was just in it because he couldn't get to his divine feminine in a way that he wanted to. That he fell into somebody else's, you know, sandbox and started playing in there. All right, what else you know about this divine feminine best friend, uh, aunt, sister? <laughs> what you know? That you're doing your thing. That you've been patient, you've been working hard. Your success is building. She can see you working on yourself. Being unbothered. What else you know, best friend, sister, aunt, cousin? Talk about about this about family. Okay. There we go. Thank you. She said, let me get it right. I said, let me get it right. All right. All right, she can see he's coming to you. Yep, here he comes. She goes, be careful, though, she said, because he's nasty. He's horny, because y'all ain't seen each other in a while. She said, but this time it's not lust. She said, this time he wants the union with you. He's bringing the union. He's going to offer you this union. What's crazy is, guys, these cards are crazy, because she got the same thing over here. Four of wands, four of wands, knight of wands, knight of wands. It's crazy. I love these cards. All right. What else, sister, cousin, confidant, best friend? What else do you know about this family? Yeah, she can see this divine feminine has healed her heart. And look, this karmic over here, her four swords, it's in reverse. God, these cards don't lie. I can't make it up. These whole rolls in reverse. I... Okay, so the divine feminine, she done healed her heart. So she's good over there. And because she's healed, that is why the energy of the divine masculine is able to go to her. Because when you focus on yourself and not all up his ass and chasing him, that is when he comes to you, believe it or not. It's some crazy shit, but it's some real shit. Mm-hmm. All right. Best friend. Best friend, cousin, aunt, female energy in your divine masculine's life. What is the outcome? What do you see the outcome for the karmic... And the divine master. What do you see as the outcome? She said no partnership. There's no partnership there. Two of wands in reverse. She said there is no partnership there. 
Yep, no new beginnings there. All right, I'm taking that as a wrap. No partnership, no new beginnings. Yep. It was the King of Pentacles on the top, whatever. All right, best friend, cousin, aunt, female persuasion. That's the divine masculine's life. Confidant. What do you see as the outcome for the divine masculine and this divine feminine? Two of Cups. I'll be damned. This is union. This is union. This is union. This is union. Oh my shit. Oh my shit. Oh my shit. Yep. Nothing is going to stop this person this time. They thought about it. They went with them. Maybe it had something to do with the child. But they see union. Maybe it, maybe he's coming with a child and you just don't know it. Maybe that's part of it and he's going to tell you about it. But you fulfill them. This is emotional fulfillment. That's what the best friend said, guys. You heard it here first. Yep. The best friend said the divine masculine doesn't want this karmic anymore. Even though the karmic wants him, she still wants the union. The best friend, cousin, aunt, sister... The female persuasion in the divine masculine's life said this is where he wants to be. He wants to be with the divine feminine. He sees love. He wants union. It's so crazy, guys. Rewatch this video because this very last line here, they actually flipped on each other. It's like what he didn't want with the karmic is what he wants with the divine feminine. It's absolutely crazy. I love this energy, guys. It's amazing. So, somebody, this person is coming. So, if you don't know, now you know. Uh... <laughs> I'm so serious. Get ready. Clean your homes. <laughs> Dust. <laughs> your baby's coming. Somebody's coming. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. But don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Because when you hit the thumbs up, y'all know that DJ spins my records. He, what he does is he throws my records to the right out in YouTube world and it spins and it spins and then if I'm the lucky winner you know and lately people people have been spinning my records guys so please thumbs up the DJ which is me thank you G DJ inner chakras <laughs> if you can give this record a thumbs up I really appreciate it <laughs> thank you for coming out God bless you and good night bye